it stays like this that I envy the people starting in April. <laughs> there, that's better. All right, day seven. <laughs> it's a cold, windy one. Good morning, everyone. Day seven, starting off with a mountain climb. <laughs> that should warm us up. It is a cold, windy morning. As you can see, a lot of uh, frost up here, and the wind is quite strong. sure what the wind chill is but it's quite cold and of course I'm wearing shorts <laughs> we are climbing up toward Pig Pen Gap so we're getting close to the top Supposed to actually get to 52 today, so that'll be nice. That's the one thing, you never know what kind of weather you're going to get this time of year. Anyway, we'll see you up the trail. Everything's got frost on it. I don't know if you can hear the wind or not, but it's, it's blowing pretty good. First view of the day, not much of one. You can see the sun trying to peek out down there. There it comes. Down in the valley. So we are headed to Poplar Swamp Gap uh, today. It's going to be about, I think about eight miles. Uh, we'll be camping there tonight. Spooky and eerie. <laughs> and cold. It's so bad if that wind could quit blowing. So we're on the calmer, less windier side of the mountain for a change, which is quite nice. The sun, as you can see, is trying to pop out. It might take a little while. Anyway, we're about uh, four and a half miles from where we plan to camp. So uh, probably take a little break here in a mile or so. Drink a little water, get something to eat, but uh, make a pretty good time. And we're only doing about eight miles today, so we should get to camp uh, 
right around two o'clock. Good gosh, that's a that's a nice uh, flow of water there. <laughs> I know over two inches of rain, so that's uh, that's the reason for all these new uh, waterfalls. But as hikers, we the more water sources we can get, the better. <laughs> so, so I'm out here hiking too with uh, my hiking buddy for the day is Chopsticks. Hello. So <laughs> so his uh, channel is uh, Tom's Footprints, right? So, on, uh, so be sure to check him out. He's got good stuff. Well, the sun's popped out. As you can see, it's a beautiful day. And we're just pushing on. Uh, chopsticks and me. Uh, we are going to camp back there a couple of miles, but we're making some good time today. And the sun's out. We're feeling good. So we're going to push a little more to uh, Blue Mountain Shelter, which is... Yeah, it's about another three miles, so we should get there about, we're guessing around 3.30 or so in the afternoon. It gives plenty of time to set up camp, and then we're only just a, a few miles tomorrow from uh, Unicoi Pass, uh, or Gap rather, and then, uh, yeah, down to... Uh, I think I'm going to go into Helen and do a little bit of a resupply, and I'm not sure. I think Chopsticks may push on a little bit because he's meeting some family members later this week up the trail. So, but anyway, that's uh, that's what's going on now. So I'll catch up more once uh, we get closer to the shelter. A little bit of a green tunnel here going through all. Uh, Rhododendrons. Okay, so we're about uh, three miles uh, to the uh, Blue Mountain Shelter. Uh, boy, uh, sun's out, beautiful day, but it's still windy and cold. Uh, anyway, I thought I'd give you, I'm standing up here on the top of uh, not sure what the top of this one the mountain is, but uh, I'll give you a, a view of it. there <laughs> all, right. all right coming to you live from Blue Mountain Shelter this is our view from the front porch not too bad sun setting got a little fire pit chopsticks over there it was a long day he got almost 12 I had almost 13 so we uh, pushed it a little bit, but uh, anyway, here's home sweet home <laughs> for tonight. Uh, yeah, it's a good day. Cold and windy, uh, sunny, but still. All right, see y'all tomorrow.